Ron's Bass Lessons, back with another one, uh, Hold the Line by Toto, classic, uh, what is it, 80s, I think? Um, so this is in the key of E, and you got, um, let's see, you basically have your chorus and your verse parts, and that's really the only two major parts, and they, they utilize the chorus as the intro as well, so you're in... Uh, F sharp here is your first note on the ninth fret, so it's so you're on nine, four, five, and seven. So you're F sharp, uh, C sharp, D, and E. And then when they sing "Hold the Line," you can play along with them. So you can you can lead in, anticipate. The F sharp here with um, C sharp and E on your uh, ninth and seventh frets. Hold the line, you know. Um, so, but that's it. That's your intro and your chorus. All right. Um, let's see. And then, so the verses. After you do the chorus or the intro, it leads into the verses. You're going to be on seven. Five, four, back to two, and your verses start on the B note. So right, that's how you get into the verse after a chorus or after the intro. Seven, five, four, two. All right, and then your verse um, uh, licks is uh, um. Sorry, so so that's that's right, but it, it hits that B twice, so it's and that's all on the um, second, third, and fourth frets, and it does that particular uh, version um, twice in the first two times in the verse, so it's. Two, two, three, four, and then four, two, four, dropping down the next string. So, all right, and then, and then just it just walks back to the to, to the B again. So. Same notes on the um, A string, you're using two, three, and four, and on the D string, you're using two and four. And I have this as usual all tabbed out by hand, so you know, feel free to email me. I'll send you my tab in the cover version at the end of the cover, as I always do. I put the tab up on the screen so you can see it. So that's the first two times in the verse, and then it starts to it makes a slight variation. Instead of ending on the C sharp, it starts going to the D. So it's um, sorry. Um, so it climbs up to the D. So it's two, 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 four, 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 five. And then it does the same thing it just did at the second half of the other part of the verse. It's the, hits the D twice on the fifth, and it, so so it does that part twice also. It does both of the two parts of that verse twice. So um, so what we have so far is Anticipating the pre-chorus into the chorus is again climbing to the to, to the D here, but then it's gonna hit the E. So the last one is like uh, oh sorry, it's and then okay, I go that lead. 
leads right into the chorus. So, so again, that last line of the verse. So you're on two, four, five, and seven. So the whole uh, isolated bass on the verse, slow. Actually, you know what? I'm going to start with the... Uh, Sorry. Sometimes, uh, if, I, if I feel like I, I play the, I play some fifths to get a little more power, especially because the band that I currently pl play this in doesn't have a rhythm guitar player. So, so sometimes I'll. Yeah, you know, just get a little more fatness behind it. And so the solo is over twice through the chorus. Um, but it does it the first time regular and the second time it double times it. So 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 the solo's over in a regular first. I think it's four times. And then it, the second time through the solo is Is that it just goes right back into the to the last verse at the very last line of that you know like, like, like that and then it just ends on outroing on the chorus and you'll feel it they keep repeating hold the line hold the line hold the line at the end and 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 you're just following along with the vocals um, on the E. Okay. That is all the parts. So as, as long as YouTube doesn't take it down, my cover will be up for you to watch. And again, email me if you want the tabs. So thanks for watching. If you like the channel and you get something out of it, please like and subscribe and spread the word. And uh, I'll see you at the next one. Thanks very much and rock on.